Palm Beach County is made up of so much, the richest and the absolute poorest. There are pockets where there is extreme wealth. There are much larger pockets where there is extreme poverty. And there are pockets in between where there's still very high need. Some of the parents have two jobs. Some of the parents are single moms. At the Early Learning Coalition, we help parents that are both low income. We also help parents who are at risk of abuse and neglect. We serve over 30,000 children doing subsidized childcare. A huge piece of the work within the coalition is VPK, Voluntary Pre-Kindergarten, which allows every four-year-old to have preschool before they enter kindergarten. The work we do prior to kindergarten is really important. So much happens within that first four years. You feel like every minute really matters, and it does. And we're seeing more and more that these children aren't ready. Florida, the readiness rate is 60 percent. It's nationwide, and there's different ways to measure, but they all indicate the same thing. We know if you're more successful in math, that's going to help you into the future. The same thing with literacy. We were looking for a program for preschool age children to support them around building math and literacy skills. Never did it cross my mind that the solution would be a digital platform. I'm a mom of a teenage girl, and I can tell you, the last thing I want is her on her phone, so the last thing I wanted with a little one was to be on a tablet. We met with Age of Learning one morning, and they came in as a team to really tell us about this product called My Math Academy and My Reading Academy. And Aruna and I are skeptics, because it's not only the investment, it's also the trust of the child care provider community that's on the line. They showed up, and Aaron and I and our CFO met with them and our answer was going to be no. Then they started to show us how children learn. And they had these little green boxes that they would show. And if you didn't get a block, it turned red. And if you never got that block, it's gonna come back and you're gonna dip again. I started thinking about that in my life, in my child's life, and it made sense. What we did need to see was some data the data that says, yes, when we invest in our children this way, we can expect the needle to move. With my math academy, the research was really deep. And the question that's in my head is, where was this when I was a director? You know, the whole team that met with us, what was the most important thing for them is that children learn, that we get these things in the hands of children. And you didn't see that it was a business, you saw that it was education. When you have the research, when you have the team that's willing to invest with you, that you really feel like they care as much as we do, that's a great combination. My name is Michelle Hosell. I'm the director here at Northern Private School. I was getting emails from the Early Learning Coalition regarding the Age of Learning program. They have a math and a reading program. I didn't want to sign my teachers up to do yet another thing. So I was like, okay, let me go to the meeting. What can it hurt? So we're seeing this little game and I'm like, this is actually fun. Wow, this is something the kids would love. So the Early Learning Coalition came to opportunity to bring us the tablets for the My Math Academy. And in an instant, the students were engaged in getting on and getting their profiles done and getting their passwords. And they started right away with My Math Academy. It was simple. Um, even our teachers that consider themselves um, very untechnical, they said it was easy. They were delighted. I was a little scared at the beginning. It will be too hard or too complicated for the kids to use, but they love it. When I found out about My Math Academy, at first I was like, what is this new assignment? <laughs> But after seeing the results and seeing how they had a love for it, I was like, okay, I like this, I like it. They think they're playing, they are learning so much. It's easy, fun, and exciting for them every day. Very quickly, the teachers were commenting on the usefulness of the information provided to them as the teachers. Each one of them are on different levels. So one might be counting backwards from 20, and then the other one might still be between one and five. So you get to see what they do know and what they may need help in. 
but it also gives the student enough time to practice that skill set before moving to the next. With scaffolding, it's the support system that's needed to learn a new skill. So as a child learning a new skill, you're going to provide more support. And that's what my math academy can do. As a teacher, using my math academy and my reading academy with my kids has been an amazing experience. And it's been so excited to look at the data and look at my kids, how the kids are improving. After the first week, I think it was, one of the teachers came to me and just so excited and was telling me all of this information. And I didn't know this, that that child needed or this, that that child had accomplished and said, I'm changing my lesson plan for next week. The data shows that my math academy is working and it's moving them to where they need to be. And we've barely been into it a month. I just got a call about an hour ago, one of our first rounds of early data. And it's so exciting when you hear that in two to three weeks, we've already seen the needle move. To see these children, who probably would have only 60% of them would be ready for school, move in two weeks from no prior knowledge to what Age of Learning calls mastery, that's pretty amazing. What I see for the future is a lot of growth. I can't wait to see what's next. From all the rollouts, I've never experienced anything like this, and it's thrilling, thrilling. I am so happy that we have my math academy and my reading academy, and my students absolutely love it. and getting their assessments done.